feeling in my bones I could feel it in my veins Hands in the sky I can feel the winds of change You live and you learn And I hope I've seen enough To make something right And make up for what I Surprised by you Want you to make my heart feel as much as I know it should Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today is another special day because we are going to tour a very special home here at Sky Canyon by Lenar and this home has a very nice community, it's a gated community and with Lenar everything's included. They have that trademark so I'm pretty excited about that. Before we proceed, let's do three things. One, let's subscribe to the channel, let's like this video and share this video to your family and friends that will be appreciated. After this video, check out the channel page. There's a lot of home tours there for you to enjoy. Alright guys, I'm super excited. Join me, let's do it this whole together. All right, guys, this is the Queen model, right? They have that nice stonework there. This is your two car garage. And we're gonna go on the side here because this is where the entrance is. Okay. Ooh, upon entering the house on your left side you can see your stairs immediately so that's the stairs before we go up we're gonna go first to your main living area here we go this is your main living area this is not the biggest but it feels very cozy in here, right? You just need a lot of lighting, recess lighting to make it more brighter. This kitchen looks very nice. Here we go, guys. Right, they use the backsplash and this quartz has that sparkle. You have your um, microwave there. Would have, would have been nice if it was, if it is a vent hood. But this is how it looks like, guys, when you are at the corner of this dining area. I'm gonna go on the corner here. Okay, so this is your kitchen. And this is how it is when you're at, in the middle of your island. Again, guys, Really nice that Lennar included that water flirt filtration system so that you had you don't have to worry about having clean water. Let's go on that very corner of this living room area so that you can see how it feels when you are at the corner of your living room area. This is the that is the door we've entered into a while ago. This is a pretty uh, straightforward design. So let's check out what's happening on this area. Okay, so there is a half bathroom here. Hello guys. All right, half bathroom. And again, they utilize the storage space here, I believe under the stairs. Yeah, so that you still have that extra storage space there of your seasonal items such as Christmas decor, Halloween costumes. And again, they have this garage area which they normally close, understandable. They might have some items there. And you will have that uh, future green, green car charger. Let's check out your pantry. Again, it's not the biggest for this square footage. It's just about right. 
Okay, pretty simple design. You have your dining area there, your kitchen here, and then your living room area. This is ideal for those that wanted to downsize or doesn't need a lot of square footage, easy to maintain. Okay, let's get to your second floor. Let's see what's happening there. Again, this is a carpet, but you can definitely opt for a vinyl plank or a hardwood. Left, right, let's go to the left. Oh, okay, so upon entering the left, you can immediately, I believe, is your primary bedroom. Right, this is your primary bedroom here. They have that wall design there. And this is how it looks like when you're at the corner of your primary bedroom. I'm seeing your bathroom there. But before we go there, let's check out your closet first on this side. Oh, wow. This is a very spacious closet for a second, uh, meaning for, for this square footage, this closet is pretty spacious. Yeah, this is a very spacious one for this size of a house. Really nice. Okay, so let's check out your bathroom and then we'll check out that balcony, right? Hello, guys. Again, everything's included here, guys, except for the flooring, which they probably upgraded into mid-tier. And this is your toilet area. And that is your shower. Pretty standard shower. You can definitely upgrade this if you want, like make it more impactful by installing really nice um, wall tiles. But the shaker cabinets looks pretty. They are very beautiful. Okay, let's go out and check out your balcony it's so nice to have a balcony like this because what happens is you will be able to see the sunset right there was a sun there a while ago but this is the mountain range i'm going to expand it quickly right so this is your mountain views on your balcony pretty nice and then this is a very spacious um balcony here the good thing is they've already put this railing which makes it more spacious you can put like seating arrangement here right very nice okay let's go back and check out your other secondary bedroom i'm gonna close the door there okay i did close the door check out what's the design, hello guys, of your secondary bedroom. It's quite, uh, yeah, okay. So I opened the light so you can see, guys, your laundry area, pretty spacious. Now we're gonna go in this area, but let me, yes, okay, so the lights is on now. First secondary bedroom. The lights, it looks dark in here. But um, good thing you were able to fit this table here. And then you have your window here. You have your balls there. Okay. A decent size, but I'm seeing a walk-in closet for the secondary bedroom. This is nice, right? This is nice to have a uh, walk-in closet for a secondary bedroom. That's ideal. Okay, I don't know if this is a shared bathroom. Let's see. Hello, guys. So let's open the lights here. Oh, yes, it is a shared bathroom. Jack and Jill. Two sinks. Because I'm seeing the bedroom there, which we will be visiting also. So this is how it looks like, guys. This is ideal because someone else can use the uh, this counters here. And someone else can close the door there and take their, their shower. So that's very efficient layout there. 
This is very standard, nothing really special, but you definitely you can make it more interesting if you want by installing really nice tiles. Okay, since we're already here, let's check out your another secondary bedroom. This is also a very spacious one. You can definitely put like a queen size bed here. And this has a larger window than the other. Look at the mountains here, right? The range of the mountain. I don't, I can't remember if this is Mount Charleston, but I'm just guessing. But look at how the uh, sun is, is lighting up the uh, mountains there. And that's the freeway that I was talking about. That we are very near freeway, but it's so silent here, meaning the insulation is pretty good. Okay, really nice uh, wall uh, design. Look at this, guys. Really nice. Okay, so this is your secondary bedroom. And again, impressive, right? For a secondary bedroom on this square footage with this walk in closet, this is a steal. Really nice. Okay, let's go back to the main area. And this is how it goes down, uh, meaning how, this is how it looks like. I just noticed this is a really tall ceiling here. This is how it looks like, right? When you go down, and this is again your main living area. But before I forget, we need to check your backyard. And they closed it. I don't know if we can enter it. I believe there might be an entrance at the back. I saw the gate was open a while ago there, so we might be able to check it out. Okay guys, so I am at the side corner of the gate. And this is how your backyard looks like. Really nice. They have this greenery here, which makes a lot of sense. When you have this small space of a backyard, it will make a lot of impact if you have this greenery here. And this is how it looks like when you're at the back of your home. I believe you can put like a very small swimming pool here. Right, very, very small, I think. Not too big. And this is how your patio looks like. That's the entrance from the house. And this is it, guys. Really nice, even though it's just a greenery, it's easy to maintain because those are artificial grass. Actually much easier to maintain, but it looks green. Okay, so that's your backyard. Thank you so much guys for watching the entire tour. Don't forget to write your comments down below. What do you think of this home? And also don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like this video and share this video to your family and friends. Also check out the channel page for more home tours. There's a lot there that you might enjoy. Again guys, thank you so much for your support. This channel is growing because of your continued support, so I really appreciate it. Until next time, have an amazing day today.